were you were you trying to turn Noah out? No. Oh my God. Stop. <laughs> Noah is straight. Period. Stop. Fletcher, you're born to their sexuality. You can't change that. You can't Trust change me, I learned the hard way. Uh, you guys, welcome back to my channel. Oh my God. So we are doing some late night motherfucking tea. If this is your first time on my channel, my name is Sebastian. I welcome you guys with open arms. It is. Hey Google, what time is it? Hey Google, what time is it? It's 10:26. 1026 on a Sunday night. I was just in the middle of watching Sister Act 2. If you guys never watched that movie, we'll be go over it. Please watch it, it's amazing. But anyways, you guys, I was just scrolling, 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 and I saw some updated tea for you guys, so I had to, you know, I have to update you guys. So make sure you hit that subscribe button because it doesn't matter what time it is, what I'm doing, I'm always serving you tea, bitch, because I need to keep your ass hydrated, okay? So subscribe, share if you can, and like, and just help a bitch out. So you guys, you know all the talk that's been around with Noah, right? Noah Beck. So I already made a video today about a lot of people questioning his sexuality. A lot of people saying that he acts quite feminine. A lot of people saying, you know, this is the real reason that he is not with Dixie is because he's gay and stuff like that. And my, my comment on that is, it is nobody's damn business, okay? If he is straight, gay, he loves light bulbs, he loves Hey Google. He's obsessed with Britney Spears. Like it doesn't matter what he is or who, who, uh, what he, how he identifies with himself. That is his issue and his problem. But all the social media is talking about this. So I did a video, um, kind of defending that you know he didn't have to express it. So there's also another side to it because there's a lot of chit chatter everywhere about is he gay, is he not gay? And I'm over here like it is none of your damn business. You know what I mean? Um, so tonight. Loray, Dixie, Charlie, Noah, um, what is Lil Huddy and James, did I already say James? And Charlie and Dixie and Noah, well, you know, the regular gang. They went to Boa. These people only know two restaurants. They either go to Boa or they go to um, Saddle Ranch. I live so close to both. I need to start like going out there like, like you know, spotting the, the for tea, you know, but like, you guys have some tea for me, bitch? Oh, you know what? Tea on the go, honey. Tea on the motherfucking go. Okay, so listen, you guys. Watch me Watch me become, like, a, the new, like, paparazzi. Oh, my God, that would be so funny. Anyways, you guys. Um, so, Fletcher from Hollywood Fix, which he is so sweet, by the way. But he actually interviews the Ray. And this is what happened. So, as you guys can see... Oh wait, did I already put this in the beginning? Oh bitch, I don't know, but you know what? This is me being messy. Ooh, once again, this is what you guys get. We get the best friend vibe. Um, but yeah, I think I already put it in the beginning, right? Editing feature Sebastian, that's so Raven, have a vision. Yes, um, definitely going to be putting this in the beginning. Hey Google, play the theme song for that's so Raven. All right, that's so Raven theme by the hit crew. Playing on YouTube music. By the hit crew. You might think life would be a dream. Oh my god, this video is gonna go viral, and I'm gonna wake up to 1,000 subscribers more. <gasps> This is what dreams are made of. My neighbor is gonna probably hit me. But anyways, you guys, anyways, you guys, so James Charles, I love when he said he had to learn the hard way. We all know why. And Lorraine answered it perfectly and so did James Charles. I believe you are born the way you are. And you know what? If no one wants to be gay or straight or bi or curious, that is his issue, that is his problem. And I honestly think having said it by Lorraine and James, I think honestly does help a lot and because Fletcher also asked um, no I believe it was last night or t earlier today at Saddle Ranch so I think he's just getting this a lot and um, you know this is this is the annoying part and I'm just gonna say like when you get a straight male who is so secure with himself and he can be feminine be masculine you can be whatever you want to be you don't have to put labels on people you don't have to put titles you don't have to Gay people act feminine, straight people act masculine. That's not true, you guys. It's just not true. Girls don't have to be feminine. Boys don't have to be masculine. It just, you are what you are and that's it, period, right? 
So I love the message. I love that, okay, if we can just, you know, end it here. And Lorraine and James did a perfect job for it. So what do you guys think in the comments? Let me know. Let's talk in the comments. I love you guys so much. If you can please share all my videos that you watch, I would be so grateful. It helps me out so much. Subscribe, share, and I love you guys so much. And have a beautiful day.